Do you even know what model it is? Are you even a man? I don't know anything about cars. Shut up. Go on, what make? Uh, Fiat, I think. What do you think? Oh, maybe, maybe it's a mini. I don't know. It's red and it takes petrol. <laughs> oh, you're useless. Well, I know things that you don't. What, like pissing money away? You even got a job yet? No, not yet. No one's getting back to me. I've got a car now, though, so it should be easier. You know, walking's quicker, mate. Unless you want a job ten miles out of the city. Yeah, true. I was thinking about a career job, though, you know, a Domino's driver or something. Why, well, that'd give you plenty of time to plan the slots, wouldn't it? Nah, I don't do any of that anymore. Yeah? Yeah. Hmm, what are you doing later? I've got work in two hours, so I'm going off to Claire's parents' house to live. Mate, do you mind uh, spotting me for my food? I'll, I'll get it back to you. Again? Mate, I'll, I'll get you the money, I promise. Okay. But soon, yeah? Very soon. How much now? Well, it's 50 some pounds, mate. <laughs> Easy. You only need to win once, right? James, don't be a dick. I'm gonna get you the money. Did I say you weren't? Look, 50 quid's easy, mate. I can win it for you. Well, it's more like 60 quid, mate. I thought you were gonna get yourself a job. Just don't worry about it, okay? Fuck off. Excuse me, are you Brady Thornhill? Yeah. Are you going somewhere? Yeah, I clumped it, mate. I've got a piece of paper here saying you owe money to Quick Cash Online. So where's the money, mate? I, I don't have the money just yet. I, I need to get to work. It says here you haven't even got a job. Look, I, I will get you the money. Just, just unlock my car, please. It's not going to happen, mate. Listen, I have the authority to take this money back today and in full. So let's stop messing around and get this sorted. Can I give it back in, in instalments? Can I set up a plan or, or, or something? Not gonna happen, mate. I'm gonna come inside and have a look. Why? Why, 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 why can't I pay you back in small bits? I don't have the money right now, honestly. The debt will only get bigger the longer you leave it. I'm gonna come inside and have a look. Come on, get out of my way. Excuse me. What do you think you're doing? I'm here to collect a debt from Brady Thornhill. Mm-hmm. And who sent you? I'm a private contractor, sir. Yeah, I guess that, but who sent you? That's really relevant to you, sir. I'm here to collect a debt from your son. It's the law. Bollocks. You ain't coming to my ass. I've got the paperwork right here, mate. Bollocks. Get your phone out and film him now. All right, sir. I would like you to go on record and say how you think you could enter my house. That's not what I said. <laughs> yes, you bloody did. You know what? If you're not going to listen, I'll get the police down here. Okay. They'll sort it out. Well, go on then. I'm sure they know the law better than you do. I'll be back another time. Yeah, yeah. Get off my property! Absolute disgrace. Absolute disgrace. Wait a minute, it's put a clamp on my car. Oi! You! Get this clamp off my car now! That clamp will be removed when the debt gets paid off. You try and remove it, you'll be breaking the law. I'll be back another time, like I said. Don't touch me! We're on the street now, you ain't touching me. 
Get the police out of you. It can't be next Thursday, it's got to be today. If you're not open on Sunday, then why isn't he taking calls? You didn't deserve that. Not at all. I was just trying to leave the house. Just thuggy people. They're the ones that want to be bailiffs. Do you want a cup of tea? They can't do it about it till Friday. My car is parked in front of yours, so I don't know what you're going to do till then. Absolute wankers. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry's not good enough, Brady. How much do you owe? Um, only, only like a hundred quid. It was a hundred quid when you got the loan. It'll be double that by now. Do you realise how serious this is? Dad, it's fine, honestly. <laughs> Pretty, it is not fine. People don't just forget about debt. It's a whole sodding industry. I knew you weren't responsible to have a car. The car has nothing to do with it. George. No, 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 no. It's about time you learned. It's typical of you. Every time we give you any kind of responsibility, you go and abuse it. I'm taking off the insurance and you are going to get a job, any job at all, until you pay that loan off. But it's just going to keep growing. I'm not going to have enough money in time. You better get a job quickly then, haven't you? And get out of those sodding gambling sites. It's not healthy enough. It's not them that's the problem. I'm just not hearing back from any jobs. Well, what if we gave you some money towards it? No, no, Ava. He's got to learn sometime. He can pay us back. No use the debt growing. We can pay it off and Brady can get it back to us. Yeah, I, I will. I promise. You'd better. Oh, yeah, this is Brady Thornhill. I... Yeah, I took a loan out from you. I've just realised I don't need the money anymore. You know, I literally just took the money out. Nothing you can do. Oh, is this quick cash online? Yeah, this is Brady Thornhill. I have an overdue loan that I need to pay off. Yeah. What? Yeah, I know it's increased. I just wanted to ask if I can pay off the amount I initially borrowed. I, I can't afford the full amount right now. I know I need more time. Right. No, oh, babe. <laughs> you can't get over that easy. 
Look, I've got your routers on my phone. You can check any time. <laughs> no, it's definitely your turn to cook, Claire. Look, no, I'll eat whatever. It's fine. I love you, yeah? Just don't poison me. Fuck's sake, Jim. Ready, we did. We did. Yeah, I know. We didn't get it. Why did I talk to you? Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Right get now. a job. Yeah, I'm looking, no one's getting back to me. You're not looking hard enough. It's easy to get a job. Yeah, sure. Don't put fucking money in there. What have I told you? Yeah, I know what you told me, but it's, it's fine. Is it? You're not going to win that money. For me, yeah? You don't know that. Yeah, I do. The job's easier. When are you gonna fucking learn? Listen to me, yeah? I'm only looking out for you. Yeah, alright. Alright. Don't bother putting money in that again. Hi, Mom. Hi, love. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. What time will you be back from work? Not long, but don't lock up just in case. I know you don't want to talk about it, but you are keeping up to date with the payment schedule, aren't you? Uh, sorry, Mom. I've not been able to. The shop won't pay until the end of the month. Are you sure you can't ask? No, I can't ask. They'll probably fire me. Okay, then, love. I trust you, but do try and get that money sorted.
see you. What's up? Oh, you're all right, Eva. I'm, I'm good, thanks. How's you and George? Oh, we're same old, same old at the moment. A bit frazzled recently, but doing just fine. George has just popped to work now, actually, so just me and Brady in right now. George has got to work this early? Yeah, he's, he's having to carpool at the moment. They came and clamped the mini, so... It's been a bit of a nightmare for us at the moment. Well, um, you should just cycle. <laughs> I've already suggested that to him, but he never listens. So, Brady's in here? He is, yes, but I think he must still be in bed. He had a long shift last night, apparently. Come on in, James. I'll, I'll put the kettle on. That's OK, Ava. Um, just came to talk to you quickly. Okay, well, have a good day then, love. And wait Brady up for me, will you? Brady. Hey, man, you up? Listen, I just want to talk, yeah? Last night was a fucking disgrace. I'm sorry for blowing up at you like that. I know you struggle with that stuff and I shouldn't have lost my shit, yeah? I just want to help you. Look, I'm, I'm sorry for the way I acted, okay? But I still stand by what I said. You've got to stop lying and telling people you've got a job and just come clean. It'll make everything better. Yeah, that, that is shit. But you're making it a bigger deal than it actually is. But that's what they do. They get in your head, man. They make you think it's the end of the world. But it ain't. You just gotta stand up and deal with it. You can do it, man. I'm, I'm coming in. Hey!